you've got an organization in Troy that is celebrating the Tri-City Valley Cats because, you know, of course, they are an affiliate of the Houston Astros. And so we have a couple uh, former Tri-City Valley Cats right now playing in the World Series. Joining us this morning, Matt Callahan, the general manager for the Tri-City Valley Cats. Welcome. Thank you, Heather. What has it been like watching the series? I was worried if they didn't come back after having lost those first two games, should we cancel? You know? <laughs> yeah, it's it's been a wild series so far mm -hmm. with the road team winning every game, but um, the Astros have battled back. It was fun to see uh, some of our former players play a key role last night, and it's a brand new series now. And it's interesting because I wasn't even aware of uh, <clears throat> the starting pitcher last night, Jose, your Quiddy is how they're Urquidy, pronounced. Urquidy. Urquidy. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, when he played for the Tri-City Valley Cats, he was Jose Hernandez. He just has changed his name to his mother's last name. Correct. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And, you know, he, he played a huge role last night, five shutout innings. He was only with us a couple years ago. And, you know, he's kind of an unsung hero in the postseason run right now. So that was pretty special. The big name, everyone's talking Jose uh, Altuve. He played uh, several games with uh, your organization back. He did, yeah. He was, uh, he was with us in 2009 mm -hmm. along um, with several other key players. And um, Jose, you know, he just keeps getting better every year. And he's such a, a cornerstone of the Astros organization right now. It's pretty special to see him play. It is. And yet another one we've got. Oh, yes, we're taking a look. You see, there, there was Altuve right there in the Tri-City mm -hmm. Valley Cats outfit. We have... A Springer jersey. Talk a little bit about uh, what he's doing there for the Astros. Yeah, George Springer, mm -hmm. another uh, key key contributor for the Astros, was with us. Made his professional debut right here in Troy. Uh, first round pick, and you know, as the center fielder, the leadoff guy, um, he just he's a big part of that organization and, and a pretty special player as well. Yeah, the opportunity you worked with these guys. What do you see? What really drives them forward? What can make them come back from you know any slump? You know, these guys are, are professionals. They've been there. They've been on postseason runs. They're champions. They won uh, the, the, the World Series in 2017. So they know what it takes. They know that every game matters. And even if you're down by, by a couple games or a couple runs within a game, if, if you keep fighting and you, know, you keep playing the right way, good things will happen. You just mentioned the 2017 World Series, Houston Astros, and so you happen to have a ring. Let's see if we can get a shot of that. If not, we're going to take some pictures and post them up for you. But, uh, yeah, this is, uh, tell me a little bit about this very special uh, ring here. Yeah, <clears throat> so when the Astros won in, uh, in 2017, I uh, was very fortunate as part of uh, an affiliate and part of the organization to receive a, a World Series ring and mm -hmm. um, pretty special. Hold it back up for us if we Absolutely. can. Let's see if we can get some sort of shot. We're going to make an attempt there. Yeah, man, we're going to take some pictures and show it to you <laughs> but you also have former players uh that uh, are winning with the Red Sox. Yeah, you know, we've, we've had um, over 60 players make it to the big leagues um, from our time here in, in the Capital Region. Uh, J.D. Martinez won the World Series last year with the Red Sox. Uh, Dallas Keuchel was in the playoffs this year, pitched for us um, back in 2009. So um, we've been fortunate to have a lot of, of really well-known players come mm -hmm. through, and it's awesome to see their success at the big league level. It really is, and you know, they come through with the hands of guys like you. So, I mean, you play a role in this, so no matter what fan you are of what major league team come out and you never know who you're going to see come up through the ranks at the Tri-City Valley Cats. Thank you so much Matt Callahan for joining me this morning and sharing your story and your ring and uh, and all of the success. Thank you. Hope it continues. Absolutely. Thank you.